Yo, what's up, y'all? Today we're talking about free speech, or the illusion of free speech, or the actual lack of free speech we have in today's society. So you hear it on the news, you see videos, you look, you see articles all the time about people being punished, reprimanded for things they do or say on social media. And it's kind of disturbing. Even if the punishment is justified, even if the person was in the wrong, I feel like people should be free to say what they want to say. However ugly, however nasty, however wrong it is. At the same time, people should be allowed to, you know, fight back and say, you're wrong, that's not right. I don't think people should be scared into silence. I think we should all have a meaningful conversation without, you know, saying, You are bad. Go be quiet. There is a saying on the internet I saw about tolerance, about how there's a paradox of tolerance. So, tolerant society be a, a tolerant society has to be tolerant of intolerance. Otherwise, it can't be considered a tolerant society. Something like that. You know what I'm saying? Because who has the right to say this is wrong and this is right? A truly, purely tolerant society would be tolerant of all things, including intolerance. I think the people that are intolerant of intolerance probably fear that that intolerance will spread like a virus and infect the populace and make the society bad, but I don't think that's necessarily what would happen. I think a truly good society that has unity consciousness grows up little by little together, and we don't have to police every single thing people do or say. It will just naturally rise up. I think that's what is actually happening. You see a lot of bad things, school shootings, you see North Korea and a lot of economic injustice, but I think you're seeing an underground bottom swell movement, people awakening. And eventually we awakened people will outnumber the unawakened narcissists out there. And we will be truly an empathic society. I'm not saying we should let these people say whatever they want to say or do whatever they want to do without consequence that would be paradoxical i think my i think my problem is that we tend to gang up and jump on these people jump on these ignorant people like bullies and i don't think we should do that we are so quick to fire people for what they say and do and i always wonder is that really the best course of action just to silence people into submission I never, we never hear about these people get fired from their jobs or they get belittled on Twitter for saying something. We never hear the after effects. We just condemn them and then we just toss them aside like the garbage. And I think that's wrong. People make mistakes and we should all love people equally, even if they may do ugly, disgusting things. Well, thank you for joining me on another video. Have a great day.